All right, one last little look. I think we're I think we're good, guys. I think we finally did it. We got back to where we need. All right, so we need to return back to tier because I believe our last side mission that we picked up, if I'm not mistaken, uh, I'm looking for goals, side missions, or favors. The time heals all. I don't know if we can. We can go there. We just can't fast travel there. So that kind of sucks. But it'll be all right. We could just boat there, but I feel like we need to start doing some story stuff here soon. I don't know. We, we may go back to Fafnir's. It's a, it's a fairly decently easy a way to go. If Ymir was the first giant, where did he come from? In the beginning. There was Ganungagal, the great void. There were no realms yet, only primordial forces. There was fire, and there was ice. And there in the void, they met and produced... Water? More than water. The mystic lifeblood of something entirely new. From this water, Ymir took form and became a being of pure creation and chaos, mother and father to all that came after. Even the Aesir? Aye. Every god, man, and beast came first from Amir's flesh. Though it was the Aesir who thought themselves so superior that they should hold dominion over the rest of creation. It was Odin who took arms against his creator and spilled Amir's lifeblood with his spear. A necessary evil, he would say, to bring order to the realms. From Amir's torn flesh, Odin would fashion the realm of Midgard for his own. Called himself All Father, as if he was the creator and not the creator's destroyer. Mm. Small, covetous tyrant. Whoa! I don't remember Mir being. Oh, sorry, my boy. Ah, uh, you know, I think at best we just end it there, actually. Yeah, dude, I don't remember Mimir being so against Odin, but I guess Odin did imprison him, so it does make sense in the context. Um, and what I know, very limited, obviously, of Norse, the reason why they call him the Allfather is because um, he is the father of all. He he created man. He, he made Ask and someone else. I forget what their names are. Uh, let's just say Abel or whatever. And... Uh, no earthly key nor they spawn all of humanity, very similar to Adam and Eve. Don't even look at it. So that's why they call him All Father. But, you know, obviously lores and mythologies can change, in fact, uh, their interpretations. As they're all, most, not all, but mostly oral histories and tales. Ooh. Gotta grab that. I see something down there. Me too, boy. Me too. Let's grab that one. That's more gold. Gotta get this barrel. I'll never stop. I don't know why I feel compelled to do all these. I don't know if anyone else is the same way, but man, anytime I see something floating in the water, I got. I, I just want to make a beeline for it. So I think that tells me that at one point I gotta do the realms that are mostly challenge based so that I can start just collecting all this uh, extra stuff quickly. Yes, we can, but do I want to? There's a stank bitch over there, but I don't know how else I can break that pot over there. Okay, hold on. Let's go. F ah, shit. Where am I going? Uh, where am I going? I'm trying to get over here. But. No, that's the river. Is it under where your wonder is? Is that how I get back there? I don't know if he's blocking that. Hold on. Let's go this way. I got turned about a little bit. Got a little turned about. Oh. Um. I guess I haven't been back here since we lowered the river, so... I don't remember going through... Bones. <laughs> I feel like I would have paid attention to the bones that were here before. Yikes, dude. I mean, it's cool. Don't get me wrong. I just... I'll make sure I'm going the right way. <laughs> I mean, the compass isn't leading me astray, so I think we're, we're all right. 
cool. Uh, hopefully this elevator leads us to where I want to be. <laughs> yeah, okay, so this is the dock that we were at before. It's just now that the uh, the water has been lowered, we are uh, we need the elevator to get up. Cool, 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 cool. Good to know. And then we'll unfortunately have to go... I hope not all the way through the the dungeon again. We should just be able to run through because the forest has been unlocked. Okay, don't need to talk to him for the side mission. Man, I really should have been paying attention. I, I need to make sure because uh, my counter, my official uh, buddy counter isn't here. But uh, anytime Kratos says boy, I need to be the, the arbiter of... Um, keeping track. Now, the question is, are there going to be... Yes, enemies are in fact respawned over here. That did not take him out, surprisingly. I thought that would. Alright, let's get in there. And finish it. Ooh, ooh. Got slid, dude. Uh, that didn't kill him either. Uh, I don't know why that happens, but we maybe it's because we had a bunch of enemies around us. It just, like, kicked us out based off the deformation meshes or the collision boxes, I'll call them. <gasps> Kratos praising Atreus. You did well. Always been asking for that forever. Treasure? Didn't know that was there. Nice, dude. Let's see if this completes one of the treasure maps that we got. Eternal Frost. Used to upgrade pommels with frost damage effects. Eye of the Runic Master. Legendary enhancement. Taking damage during a runic attack reduces, reduces damage by 15. Nice. I do get hit. Treasure map the Historian. Actually was one that we needed. Cool. All right, we're not totally in the clear. There's still an opening over here, so... If enemies... spawn up on us... it will be here. No, nope. Looks like we're good. What are you fools doing back here? Come to pill for my boots and small clothes. No. You asked us to do a thing, didn't you? We found your son. He... he was betrayed too. And we found part of his journal. It sounded like he regretted killing you. <laughs> Fat lot of good that does me. How'd he go out? Did I fight him? We found four corpses near his. They were decapitated. Ha! <laughs> Vandrid always did keep his sword nice and sharp. A lesson he picked up from me. <sighs> He's a backstabbing bastard, but... No one he's in Valhalla sets me at ease. Thanks. There it is. And a legendary tear shard. Nice. Bonus to all stats. That thief did not deserve the peace you gave him. Maybe so. Still, it feels good to help people. Time heals all. So much like your mother. A uh, legendary enhancement. We may need to go to the shop and check that one out. Upgrade to all stats, but... It's probably going to be, let's be honest, like two or three, but with Legendary, maybe it's like plus six to all stats, and at least for now in the beginning of the game, that feels like it's pretty huge, so definitely got to go check that enhancement out. And then we'll, we'll get back into the story. At least until the point where you can start fast traveling, because I think even the, I'm going to assume, but I think even the Bifrost gates are closed to us right now, so we can't even jump realms. I'm going to have to rewatch this whole, uh, 
first part of God of War. I honestly couldn't tell you if he, if he called to trace boy. <laughs> I've already I've already failed at keeping track. All right, let's see here in my uh, upgrades. Where do I put enhancements on? Oh, God. Well, don't the one thing I don't like about all this is I feel like the inventory menu stuff is so much more complicated than it needs to be. Um, high perk activation chance, protective barrier preventing damage on any successful parry. That's pretty good. That's my second one over here. It's a purple. Reduces the rage. Eh. I feel like plus six, plus one to cooldown. Blood goes up by 10 though. It's not bad. That's really good. Like that's really good, right? I think we can all agree. Let's do that one. Legendary. Have to. And if we start getting better, I could put a socket here in my talisman? Bro. I didn't even realize that. Okay, well we can go back and get the Eye of Fury there. I hope that talisman stays as long as I have a um, enhancement socket. Like if I have to take it out every time I equip something, I'm gonna be kind of annoyed. I'll be straight up honest with you. Okay, um, I think it's time to go back to I assume Tears Temple. No, yes, and I really don't know what our main mission is. Where's my uh, goals? Only a very special chisel can carve the travel rune to Jotunheim. The serpent says that to get the real highest uh, to the real highest peak, we need two things: the secret travel rune for Jotunheim and a piece of magic chisel to carve with. First, we're sailing off to find the chisel, which is over here. Okay, past the Council of the Valkyries. Okay, cool. We're doing exploration then, discovering new parts of the world. Perfect. <laughs> Perfect. That means I get to go in the boat and collect a bunch of gold and, and hacks over by crashing into barrels. What's up, Eps? How you doing today? Thank you so much for the 25 months. Two years, one month. How, how are you? How's the start of your week been so far? I also saw that um, you sent me an uh, invite to get back into 14 with some uh, perks and bonuses, which was super nice. I, I'll have to uh, think about doing that. We may, uh, I don't know, I, I'm not going to, no, can't, I was going to say, we may make October our <laughs> uh, 14 Stormblood month, but I realized that October is spooky game month. Can't do it. I deprive yourself off of Metal Hellsinger. Dude, how are you enjoying it? What level are you at? I uh, personally have been playing a little bit of it myself. I got to like the fifth level and I could not get on the beat. The one where you get the crossbow, wherever that one is, I couldn't find the beat. I couldn't do it. I had to, I don't want to say give up, but that, that I, I struggled on that level. It was so difficult. I was doing so well on all the other ones. That one screwed me. So I'll have to get back to it. I was uh, two past that one been clearing all the sigils. Yeah, I was having that levels sigils again. Tough. Um, I was thinking about maybe turning off the extra sound effects so that I could um, focus on the music more because like I'm getting caught up with like the shotgun is my favorite right now and it has a different tempo. I'll call it than some of the other weapons and uh, with like the shot shot you know sort of thing so i've been kind of getting messed up but overall the aesthetics of it the music it's a good one right the next weapon is the best weapon oh shit no hold on i think i made it past that it's it's the claw thing right where it like throws out and it like sticks to the dudes right is that the weapon you're talking about though is that yeah i got that one i couldn't figure out the timing on that one though but i i played around for like 15 minutes before i had to go Shotgun is good. Uh, it's my Punisher. I use Crows exclusively. Crows is the the next weapon, right? Those like claw things that you throw out. Those things are really good. They really are. Gulfik. Yeah, the throwing ones. You were taken from this realm too early. 
I mean, it's just like I'm I'm also in it for the story. Like I've I've just been enjoying this, you know. What is this called? Not the outsider. Where you, is that what the character's called? The outsider? The mysterious one? The wanderer? The wanderer, isn't it? You who walks among the living, my beloved Gulvig calls to me. She yearns for peace, yet her remains lie in pieces. I beg of you, make my Gulvig whole again. You want us to collect her bones? Gross. Gulvig's sather magic knows no bounds. She can reunite you with those you've lost. Really? How? Boy, I can smell your grief, child. Rest assured, her magic is strong enough to create bridges between life and death. Mm. If only for a short while. Boy, we are leaving. That's two. I gotta make sure I got this. Hold on. Hold on. They've taken three of Sweet Gulvig's bones and spread them across the lake. That was that was definitely two boys. Got to get that count up. All right, so we got to bring the bones of this dead dudes. Uh, you know, I uh, going back on Metal House Singer. I um, ignored the challenges for so long. Um, it was like the third or fourth level that I finally understood what they were. I don't feel like they were explained all that well, and I realized how, how beneficial those things were. Uh, completely help and change the the gameplay for sure. Uh, who the hell? Oh my god, this idiot over here. This idiot over here, is he alone though? If he's alone... Oh, nope, he's not. He's definitely not alone. Are those dark elves coming up? Oh shit. Uh, not the right button. That's the one I was looking for. Okay, here we go. Um, dark elves are dead. Uh, did Atreus just kill them all? <laughs> I love it. They are they are pretty weak to the arrows and stun damage, so it does make sense. Hmm. Right, let's finish up this dude, and we are getting a lot more powerful as well with our upgrades and everything. All right. Maybe we should look for those bones. Why? Didn't you hear him? We could talk to mom again. If we keep an eye out, look if you wish, boy. That's I another one. Be distracted by this fool's errand. We are currently at 112 times Kratos has said boy since the start of this game. Uh, incredible. All right, and it looks like if we follow this this cavern, and it's going to take us to where this we want to be. We seek. What is it? I'm glad you asked, actually. I have just the story for you. Um, there was a giant once named Thamu. A very giant giant. Who, despite his mountainous size, was without question the greatest stonemason this world had ever seen. Proud Thamu or hoped to one day pass his vast knowledge onto his son. But young Hrimthur had the heart of a warrior. Perhaps the father had too much fear in him, or the son too little. Either way, the quarrel there spiraled out of control, and the overworked stonemason, bonk, struck his son. Hrimthur ran off into the night. Feeling shame and regret, Thamur chased after his son. But in his emotional state, soon found himself wandering Midgard, lost and alone. Sadly, he caught the eye of the one person he didn't want to meet alone that night, so far from home. Thor. And? What happened next? You'll see. Okay, cool. I was going to say, I don't want to go into this area without uh, finishing the story, because sometimes they interrupt each other. And it was a pretty interesting story. Ominous. You'll see. <laughs> like, <laughs> Tear coming through. Or, I'm sorry, Mimir. Mimir coming through with a great story. Thor killed him. Oh no. He fell in the village? Aye. When Thamur fell, he crushed a charming place famed for worshipping the Vanir god Njord. Thor always took credit for planning that one. But truth is, the sweaty poor bag just got lucky. 
I can't wait to meet Thor in his sweaty fatness, his drunkenness. What's up, Mr. Majora? How's your Monday going so far? Spoiler, at the end of the story, is a premise for the next, the latest Thor movies, Love and Thunder. Wow. Can't believe you come in here dropping spoilers like that, you know, for a movie that's multi-months old and a game that clearly doesn't have anything to do with that. We will take him down together. All right, hidden chamber. Uh, that thing. Do I need to? No, that's gonna come later. Let's uh, focus on this guy. Oop. Oh, it's a wolf man. I'm sorry. I uh, mistook what the frick we were looking at. Uh, do I get a finisher on this guy? No, it doesn't seem like it. Ooh, I. Um, I don't know the best way of doing that. That's unblockable. Yeah, I want to see the finisher on this dude. Oh, all right, we're doing one of these. He's a little too powerful just to insta kill. Dang. I know I shouldn't, but I'm still going to. Yeah, unfortunate. <laughs> I love this stupid magic deer. I need to see what the hell this thing is. So obviously it's a wolf or, or a werewolf. Uh, they look like wolves, but they stand upright like humans and are a lot smarter and stronger and faster. Their fur is so dense, it makes them tough to put down. They remind me uh, they remind me a little of those berserkers that father put down last summer, but wolves instead of bears. The berserkers. So I, I think I had mentioned it at the very beginning of the series, kind of my history with God of War. There's a God of War comic book for 2018 specifically that came out, and it talks about Kratos venturing into the woods every night to quell his anger, to, to grab hold of his anger, not let it control him. And he runs into some berserkers who can turn into bears. They worship the bear god, and Kratos has to go through, obviously, and kill the bear god, or the effigy of the bear god so the berserkers would stop turning into bear men so it was kind of cool uh, a disappointing comic overall because we never got to see Faye, um kratos's wife obviously atreus's mother which i was hoping they would go into more but it is what it is uh not much sorry haven't been dropped by in a while no never never be sorry about that man never be sorry uh we all have life life goes on and i've always said these streams are supplementary to you know life if you have time to enjoy them Feel free if you don't or you just don't feel freaking bothered by it. It's not even a big deal. Um, and then I'll finish reading that sentence. Uh, I just don't seem to hear boy as often <laughs> in my own travels. <laughs> it's my hype deer. Uh, it is my hype deer. I'm, I'm going to start calling it that. Go hype deer. <laughs> it's my new Pokemon. Uh, the comic sounds awesome. It's pretty good. It's pretty good. It got some good art. Uh, highly recommend if you ever get the chance to pick it up. It's short. It's only like one issue. No, it's six issues. You can probably find it in just like one collection. Um, but overall, yeah, it is what it is. I wish it was something more, but you can't do the what is, really. Uh, what did that do? That didn't seem to do anything. Yeah, I was gonna say, just knocked it down. Do we need? Can I? Can I grab it now? Oh yeah. Uh, what am I? Wait, what? That crystal's blooming again. Am I pulling it? Oh! oh, okay, I see. I was afraid to touch it while it was doing its thing, but it doesn't seem to uh, matter. We can just break all this. Kratos doesn't even take damage. Thanks. His idea. Cool. Just hitting and everything. Yeah, so I'm I'm gonna count. Two, two boys that I've added on. So we're at two boys at 112. I'm almost positive that I have missed more. And uh, I'm going to have to go through this and recount all the times Kratos has possibly said it. Because I'm having a hard time responding to chat, streaming, and playing the game, and uh, keeping track of all the boys. But we are at 112 as of right now. I don't think I'll keep track any any longer. Because uh, then I'll just mess myself up. Oh. 
can't tell if one of these dudes is alive. Not yet. What happened to the survivors? Oh, Thamur was a frost giant. When he died, his final breath froze everything. We found a, quite a few. This is a lot of hidden chambers around here. I, I want to get that ability soon, but I really don't remember what it is. The hidden chambers wouldn't be the, where the Valkyries are, would they? Have they always been hidden behind the chambers? That's a rhetorical question, by the way. Please don't answer that. We'll figure out on our own. Cool. It's palm. Careful now. Nice. Knew it. Uh, defensive favoring runic. Whoa. Plus 24 to our runic attack. For only minus 10 strength. That's that's worth it. Right? Oh no. Uh swap. Into swap. Oh, thank Christ. Thank Christ. It's still not fantastic. I wish it would just say, do you want to equip the rune whenever you selected the piece of armor? But it's not that difficult. There he is. Find the tip of that chisel. That's the magic we need. Looks like he got taken down the same way that uh, Kratos usually takes down giants and creatures of myth. Which is Enemies. epically. <clears throat> Oop. Yeah. Um, I only see the one, but I highly doubt that's going to be the case. Uh, oh, there it is. Come on, kill him like this. Oh, I can't wait to see the execution. Come on, Kratos. Oh, I wasn't expecting that jaw rip. Can honestly say I wasn't expecting him to rip off its jaw. Let's see it again. Oh, I'm not going to get it this time, though. Oh, my God. I, mm. You know, you expect like brutalities in, in certain types of games, but sometimes you just forget how much it can be. Oh, Ooh. oh shit. Draw jumping core. Stop it. Freaking stop it. No, you did not. No, you did not. God, I hate this community. <laughs> oh, God. He got me with that. Yeah, fair enough. Did I seriously miss? Are you freaking joking me? Yeah, shit. Where? Just gonna focus on this guy for now. All right, where are the nightmares at? There they are. Ooh, ooh, ooh. shit. Um, anyone else? Anywhere else? There's one way far away. Okay. Uh, is he fallen? He is. Let's grab this guy. And we should be able to finish him up. <clears throat> Just gotta go fast. Uh, it's gonna be close. It's gonna be close. Dang it. Want to get the execution on that guy. Is it still not dead? Holy shit. Or is that a new one? Oh, he was out. Alright, well, we still got it. So, Frost Dude still, thankfully take the damage from my frost axe, which is nice. Uh, increase resistance to frost by 50%. That's really good for right now. I don't, I feel like this area is gonna benefit that one. 
but I'm gonna hold off. They're not my favorite enhancements. But you know, I probably should learn to love them. Okay, so where's that chest? Atreus, to me. I'm coming, I'm coming. Uh, I need to do name. Oh, are we getting in? No, not in massive boost. Okay. All right. Let's at the very least get one of these. So either a three, a R, or a mountain. Okay. Sure. What do those symbols mean? Uh, is there a way to keep this thing up and frozen? Um, not quite that one. Huh. Oh, come on, if I could only hit this. Like an actual God of War champion. Hardest challenge in the game, apparently, is uh, getting this one. Uh, that's the, that's the one, right? That's at least one of them. Uh, upside down, not the way I need it to go. There's one. Now we just gotta find. Father, I think you should see this. This? I've already seen it, dude. Thanks. I mean, now this is something to look at, Atreus. Read it. Yes, sir. To Njord, we offer back the seas back. Ah, yes. It was believed that Njord calmed the winds and seas for the fishermen. For that, they hmm. loved and worshipped him here. Cool. Uh, story about Nord. I uh, didn't pay too much attention because I'm trying to find where that rune thing is. It's got to be around, but I feel like it's hey, hardened world tree sap. That's possibly hidden. It might be up there. Uh, that's the crystal. That's not gonna be it, but still, it's fine. I'll still take it. Hopefully, while we're doing this, we'll find what we need. I love that even though he's dead, his hair is still bustling in the winds because it's cold. His body's been preserved. Oops, wrong one. Uh, that's a challenge fight. Am I ready for that? I don't think so. But we're still going to have to try it, because I don't think I'll be coming back here, if I'm going to be perfectly honest with you. Uh, I need one of these things. And then we're going to toss it over here. Oh, there's our thing. Perfect. There's our thing. Oh, no, I tossed it where it can still get hit. Nice. And that should be it. I think that was the uh, last symbol that I needed. All right, we'll try to do the challenge here in a second, but I'm not I'm not excited for it, I guess I can say. Because I don't think I'm ready for it. Increases damage of all axe throws by 6%. Eh. Eh. I'm sure that could stack with certain things, but I don't feel comfortable putting that one on. Alright, let's get... Oh! It was just a Dust of the Realms. Alright. I thought that was going to be a fight that we had to do. It was not. That's a, that's a lesson for me, not to always just be afraid of doing... Not afraid, I shouldn't say. It's like I had no problem doing a fight. We've been fighting this entire game, but... Avoiding certain things, possibly. Got him. 
Hit him with his shock arrows so that uh, it bounces between all of them. <clears throat> Head of Thamor. How are we getting down there? I have a plan. You do? Do not act so surprised. Oh, no offense, brother, but I don't even think Thor with Mjolnir in hand could get through that much ice. Then Thor is a fool. This should be entertaining. Honest question. Uh oh. Oh. Uh, there's another boy. Not gonna count it though. Honest question. If you can punch through stone, could you not punch through ice? What's what's stronger, ice or or stone? I mean, maybe all of them. I don't really know. It's not really a, a thing I've ever thought about. Try more dudes. Just want to take out this guy first because he's just annoying. Oh shit, shield boy. Okay. Careful. Uh, that's the one I was looking for. Oh god, I'm in a corner and get them all at once. Is that it? Or is the music still playing? It is not it. I still don't think that's it. No, it is not. Oh, okay. Here comes like a troll. Well, considering that permafrost can be harder than concrete, I can only imagine how fun it is. Okay, cool. That's good to know. That is something I did not know at all. So, thank you for that information. Atreus is up on that troll, dude. Is he controlling the troll? <laughs> oh, Jesus. Oh, my God. There's so much happening right now. All right, we're going rage mode. Let's take out the little dudes at least first so I can breathe here for a second. There's way too much happening on screen right now. Too many big boys. If I can get this guy stunned. Oh, come on. Don't lose it. Don't lose it. Don't lose it. There we go. So permafrost can actually be stronger than concrete. That's uh, that's new information for me, to be honest with you. I love it. I love that we got confirmation, though. All right, this will be one troll down. All right, where's my axe? Oh, shit. Get me out of here. And I guess we can finish him up like this, too. Get the execution. Uh, if I can find this last guy. Uh, is there no one? No, I don't think there is. Okay, cool. I think my runic attack or even Atreus killed that last guy. Oh, hey, you again. Whew, that was Hold a long up. one. Sindri's over here. He's they're always everywhere. <laughs> I shouldn't even be surprised when they, they show up. Especially after a big fight, you get like a lot of collectibles like this. They'll always be around. See, the problem that I have is, like, yes, it could be harder than concrete, but, like, it doesn't look like it's technically that thick, but I'm not going to judge how hard it would be to break through just based off thickness alone. Density also matters. I'm just saying, I feel like with his axe... Possibly Kratos could start hacking away and just dig themselves a hole. I watched him punch through a, a giant stone pillar before. <laughs> just saying. Power scaling? What is it? Wow, that was uh, something at the fight. Here, catch. Well, that was a waste of a perfectly good hour. How were you not seen? There is nowhere here to hide. Oh, that. It's a little trick my people can pull. A special way of not being seen. You can be invisible? 
More like I can step into the realm between realms. And your mind doesn't understand what it's seeing, so it sees nothing at all. That's how we avoid ever having to actually use the weapons we craft. It, uh, it doesn't seem to work on dragons, though. <laughs> your brother wanted to know if you're getting enough to eat. I guess I could tell him you are. Brock was asking about me? Was there meat on his breath? <laughs> You let him touch this again. The way Kratos just like fix it, so he throws it at him. Kratos is rude, but fun. Come on, then. So that's how Brock was in the temple right after the water drop. He stepped between realms. Okay, now shush. I need complete silence for this. There you go. Uh, cool. I guess we'll see if we can upgrade anything here. Uh, chest armor can, Leviathan axe, no. Talon bow, still no. Uh, we can upgrade his squiver. That's always huge. More stun potential. Definitely will take that. After that, I, uh, hmm. I guess we could try to have like a pommel or something. I'm not really sh feeling any of this, to be honest with you, though. I think. Health burst, yeah. Executioner's cleave. Successful ass kills. Which one do I have? Gift to grant strength. I like that one more. Where is it, though? Oh, I'm not an upgrade, so I can't right now. I uh, don't want to upgrade my regular armor. At least the ones I'm wearing, because this is not going to be the ones that we stick with. I could upgrade this pommel for now. Doesn't give us like a huge benefit. And this one is... I mean, let's be obvious, honest with you, like plus 10 vitality, plus 5 luck for only minus 2 strength and minus 8 runic. This one's clearly the better one to have on right now. What else uh, let's put on that uh, purple pommel. And then let's go and upgrade it once. Let's do it. Let's do it. That's my Oblivion Stone, though. I only had one of them. Tell him to keep his I think it'll be fine. I think it will be fine. Uh, hard to say how hard it is to break through ice. Apparently, subs can break two through three meters. Specifically, hardened um, subs can do eight or nine meters. So looking for more details, though, I appreciate that. <laughs> Always love, like, again, when you have just, like, a, a question like that that's just like, huh, never thought about that, and then that's all you're doing for the rest of the night. It's just like, well, got to figure out the answer. What the frick did that do? There have been too many times I'm just, like, ask a stupid question, and then I'm up for the rest of the night. Is there a point to that? Did I miss my opportunity? Weird. Also, haven't been keeping an eye out for Odin Ravens. Not at all. So, this plan of yours. Can you guess it? Knowing you, it doesn't involve standing around here. Correct. But how do we move forward? I can tell you how to melt ice on a driveway. <laughs> Helpful, thank you. Um, Boy, can't really like jump over there. So there's something I gotta do. <gasps> I happen to think he looks dashing. There's you more. Know. Did we get it on its return? Nope, we did not. Gotta be better. Also, again, gotta actually be better for more. Like, be on it. Mm, that, felt, that felt right. That's it. There it goes. My shop's right here! Ask Kratos how much he cares. Seriously, Sentry, do it. Over there! 
Okay, it doesn't look like any of the other braids have that puzzle element to it, so I think we're we're good. We heading into that building? Yes. You think they're coming inside that'll help us break the ice and get to the chisel tip? No. Mm. I'll keep thinking. <laughs> they're playing a little father-son game. Can Atreus guess what Kratos is thinking? He won't. Kratos is a man of mystery and uh, unknown talents. Ah, shit. Oh, he can get stunned pretty easily, though. Uh, I may go. Uh, what's this guy doing? Okay. Okay. Oh. Uh, one of my least favorite things in video games is when you uh, dodge through an attack, but you dodge the wrong way, so the attack still hits you. Right? Uh, I guess you could say easily, I'm looking for some invincibility frames. And when I don't get them, it makes me sad. Uh, his shield on the other side blocked all those attacks. Just kind of realized. Yep, can't attack him from behind. Atreus' uh, attacks don't matter either. So, uh, I'm just going to call back the axe. We'll just uh, attack this guy like normal. Uh, okay! No, no, no! Dodge way too early on that. Got scared. He has a delayed attack. Okay, now we can focus on this guy. Uh, what the hell's that? Sir? Oh, no. Can I break it? I see. I have no idea how to prevent that. That kind of sucks. There's someone else here. All right, I don't know what I'm... Oh. Sideways. Of course they're here. Oh, of course you're here. He's doing it again. Can I shoot it? I have no idea. Do I have to just block it? Do I just have to be ready to block that one? I think so. Uh, I hate being one hit away from death. But there was nothing I can do. Still learning that. Definitely not pretty. <laughs> yeah, but you kind of threw yourself on a sword. Listen, I got panicky. I dodged too early. I dodged behind myself instead of to the side. You know, it's funny. Like, you make fun of... Uh, movie characters who like see something or like even video games where like something's toppling this way and they're just like running with it and it's just like you just run to the side guy <laughs> you have a better chance if you just run to the side of it it's a much shorter distance you have to run uh, I pretty much did that with this sword I dodged this way instead of going off to the side lessons learned lessons learned slowly but surely cool uh hi Oh. Oh? Are we going to twist it till it falls or something? Can I get Atreus on this? There's something going on with that. Alright. First first things first. Can I pull this out? Come here. You knew this place? Before? I came here on a diplomatic mission once, trying to broker a peace between Asgard and Vanaheim. A war. So many lives lost. Why yeah, exactly like that one raid. Already gone on a killing spree of giants. What do the giants have to do with the war between the gods? Nothing at all, lad. That's the tragedy of it. They took no side in that madness. But Odin's <laughs> paranoia is surpassed only by Thor's <laughs> lust for blood. I think I can get a Treus to hit one of these. Huh. So far it seems like the stone can only go here. I didn't control where Kratos put it. He kind of just pushed it. Yeah, he's, he's doing that on his own. He doesn't just stop anywhere. Hands completely off. Uh, here might be a good spot for it, though. Doesn't feel right, though. Like, he's not... For whatever reason, he's not going to be able to jump across that. <gasps> yes, he is. Oh, great. 
Chaos, you beautiful bitch. <laughs> Building PTSD. <laughs> One day I'll learn. Today's not that day, though. Heavy runic attack can activate uh, to temporarily power up the Leviathan Axe with a small explosion of frost damage on every hit and a slight bonus to runic. Oh. Small explosion. Yeah, it kind of has a shock wave that goes through. Um, I still like AoE attacks more, kind of like the get the fuck off me type of buttons. So I'm going to keep the ones I have, which I should upgrade. If I'm going to keep them, let's be honest with ourselves. This one only gives it plus one frost. The next level is plus one damage. I think I'm gonna keep this one, the Invaldi's hammer, as is. I don't feel like it's that, that great. Uh, the Elks, it does more runic damage. Um, I'm realizing that I prefer more stun than runic. So I'm gonna go back to the wolf. I'm gonna go back to the wolf. I'm always looking for a trace to do more stun damage. Okay, there we go. Trace is now fully decked out, at least for now. Uh, so we just need... I feel like we've gotten these upgrades way too fast, but we only need a few more to uh, get this one complete. So 2,000, 4,000... Uh, more okay, okay, a couple, a couple grands, over ten grand XP at least, and then we have the axe. Um, no, we probably want to pull this back out, right? Because we need to go through this way. I don't know if I needed to pull it that far, but whatever. Actually, you think you can? You totally can't get up there, right? 